never gone to undo the locking wheelet on your car and some bastard has over tightened it and the locking wheelet tool snaps. Then you realise that this type of tool won't work because your locking wheelet has a rotating ring on it so you have to get a bit creative. Then this is how I managed to remove this type of locking wheel nut from my car. First of all, I bought a 10 piece double cut tungsten steel solid carbide rotary burr for £10.29. These fit a Dremel rotary tool. Normal Dremel attachments will not cut through the steel. Get a screwdriver and wedge it against the locking wheel nut rotating ring, otherwise it will just spin around. carefully with the cutting tool, taking your time as this is a long process. Some alloy wheels may have nuts further recessed, which would make it more difficult. And some damage to the wheel may happen if you are not careful. You can see here that I have cut through the outer steel ring. After cutting through the steel ring, you will need to hit it with a punch to loosen it enough to remove. After the steel ring has been opened up, you can go in with some long nose pliers to remove it. I'm using an 18mm 12 point socket to bang over the locking wheel nut and it must be a tight fit. The socket will be ruined after this and also your locking wheel nut may need a different size socket. 